Moses Brown and Westerly from Cranston Stadium with a spot in the D2 Super Bowl on the line. MB up 10 second half, trying to put the game away, but Michael Walsh would be intercepted here by Westerly's Jacob Gilman putting the Bulldogs back in business. And after a methodical drive featuring only running plays, Tristan Toronto bust across the line and make it 10-7. But back on the Quakers, again trying to put the game away, this time success. Walsh <laughs> keeps it himself. Lunt leads, just reaches for the goal line, gets there. MB back up 10 and Moses Brown would hold on for the 17-13 win over Westerly. And they'll head to the big game, coach. We've played, we played all kinds of games this year. We came back against Love Kingstown, double overtime. Then we had a single overtime versus Shea. So we, I'm, I'm, I wasn't surprised. I wasn't surprised. These kids, I've been I've been a part of football for 28 years between coaching and playing, and this is by far the most grittiest team I've ever been a part of because they just never quit.